make movies, you can only express the enthusiasm that you have, why you think something is interesting, why you're passionate about it. And I've had the good fortune of being a part of movies that meant something to me from childhood, the Batman franchise, and Superman, and Godzilla. In this case, I've had a lifelong love of Little League Baseball and what it stands for. And I had an amazing experience here watching my hometown in the most hollowed ground there is on the planet for Little League Baseball in Williamsport. Just compelled me to want to share that experience and have people really get underneath it. On the field, of course, we get to see the kids shake hands and they're, you know, great sportsmanship. But when the cameras weren't around, I was struck by, you know, the civility and courtesy that they extended each other. Despite language barriers, despite cultural barriers, they all had this sort of commonality. And right now, here in the United States, we've, we've got plenty of sharp discourse and strife. And I remember watching these kids last summer and thinking we could all take some lessons from 12-year-olds on how to treat each other. What I love about Little League, it's the perfect blend of structure, accountability, sportsmanship. Let's be a pitcher. Let's continue to be a pitcher, right? If we do our fastballs up and in, down and away, curveball, leave them down. Be legendary. They ride that perfect line of, it's, it feels big time. It feels very adult and very, like, hey, th these games matter and they're nail biters but also realizing that these are, you know, 11, 12, 13 year old kids and that uh, sportsmanship and making sure that they have fun is the central component to the whole thing. Williamsport's a very special place. You feel the gravity of all the things that have happened there over decades and decades. But there's also an innocence about it that was tangible and all week long people were friendly. They were so concerned with making sure that the kids had a great experience. And I recommend anybody who has not made the trip to Williamsport, and especially during Little League World Series week, that should be on your list.